Hey young world, welcome back, OJ here. Today I rode my bike downtown. I'm out by the planetarium overlooking the seawall and the immaculate view of downtown. Working on a mid-tone blue today. Gonna work in some darks with the black brush pen. Gonna work in some lights with some white and silver. I'm sitting on the concrete wall wrapped around the planetarium surrounding the lake. As you curve around into the, towards the city, the first thing that you hit is the seawall here. I've known about the seawall forever. It's a legendary, legendary Chicago skate spot. It's basically a giant quarter pipe that wraps around the shed aquarium. It is, however, right on the lake, and so there's pretty much one safe spot to skate it. And everywhere else that you hit this spot, there's a high, high risk of your board going in the water. In fact, I've seen people use shoestrings like surfboard leashes people dive in after their board it's just deep enough to have your board go in and get completely wet and be a total headache to be skating again I assume they built it to protect the shed aquarium from water and waves hitting it they made it literally in the shape of a wave they say fight fire with fire but sometimes you got to fight water with water concrete water fight real waves with a concrete wave anyone who's done anything especially anybody who's touched the top legendary clips behind the seawall behind the spot is some foliage of Grant Park and of course the skyline from the perspective that I'm sitting the buildings are actually overcrowding the frame this image from edge to edge is basically filled with buildings as I lay in this black line work it seems a bit messy to me hopefully I'm gonna be able to correct that as I fill out the piece the skyline is so great that in a way it's kind of like cheating drawing something like this it's like if you're gonna draw a beautiful sunset of course it's gonna be beautiful whether you're drawing is accurate or not. Chicago skyline is simply beautiful. Now that I got the layout in, working from the back forward, I'm gonna lay in some white of the sky, establishing where the sun and that light is coming from. And because of that, there's gonna be some great, great reflections coming off the water. It separates the concrete structures and that of downtown on the other side of the lake. That way we have some depth and some negative space in here. Establishing where that light source is coming from is a major part of this because it's actually going to make it a lot easier for us establishing which side is the dark side or the shady side of each building and I'm gonna straight up fill those in lay in the dark side of every one of these buildings it is really helping this piece come together as you can see on the flip side of that we got the side of the building that is catching all the light and creating reflections and for that I'm gonna be using silver have to use silver for something like that because there's so much steel glass just a lot of reflective surfaces help these buildings read as those materials. After I got the silver filled in on all those buildings, this piece is really, really taking shape. You can feel these structures being carved out from the, the warm side to the cool side. And I'm going to come back through with some black, do a little bit of cleanup, add a few more details. I'm going to do the same thing with the silver, really make this image sparkle. I rode my bike down here to get some exercise, make these beautiful days count, also help of parking. Parking down here is a pure disaster. It's a nightmare every time I come down. Even though it's beautiful now, not a cloud in the sky over here. We got a lot of clouds rolling in over there and it actually looks like it could rain. After looking at my phone, it seems like it actually might. I got a minimum of a 30 minute bike ride back to the stew. I better get trucking before it starts coming down. Gotta do what you gotta do. I'm OJ. This is Juice Loops Live. Thank you for watching as always and I'm gonna catch you next week. Thanks everybody. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you like my Hope you like my shades